Oh, what was I doing? Where am I? I went to go eat dinner and I completely forgot everything that I was about. Okay, never mind. I do remember. <laughs> Sometimes that's what happened. Um. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean to intrude. Believe me when I say I am very sorry. <laughs> oh my god. Jesus. It's Outlast all over again. It's a complete debacle. I hope Lydia's okay. She's back there fighting the giant while I run away. I wouldn't be surprised actually. She's a tough gal. Whoa. Do you ever just randomly get like Pokemon opening stuck in your head? Like not the one everyone knows. The one that's like... You know, that I want to be the very best one, but just like ones from like the later seasons that like you didn't even watch. Because that's what I have going on with me right now. Well, I don't really want to fight bandits. I'm just trying to get to Evarstead. Oh shit, I'm doing a bad job. Am I on the right path? No one knows. Where am I going? Oh no, I need to be up there. Heh. <laughs> <laughs> I lost Lydia, but you know, she'll show up. She always does. I'm just getting farther and farther away. Jarl, you should have gave me directions. I'm excited to cut down this entire thing to like two seconds. And you guys- Wah! And you guys will be like, what's she complaining about? She's only been out here for like two seconds. And I'll be like, that's what you think, but really I was out here for 20 minutes. Just wandering the wilderness. Oh, snap like K, that sounds scary. I don't want to go in there. At least not without Lydia, and you know, she's suspiciously missing. I just, I keep trying to think about what Khajiit society must be like, and it's so weird that you can, like, have siblings, right? And one of them's, like, you know, a weird furry Khajiit person, like I am. And the other one's, like, a house cat that can't talk or anything. Like, what are families like in elsewhere? Who are you? What? I thought that you don't show up in the game for a bit. Maik wishes you well. Like I always heard they kept him in like um like his model like in a cage somewhere underneath Skyrim until the time when they released him. Much snow in Skyrim. Enough snow. I'm really surprised. Maik does not I don't think I've ever anymore. actually encountered Mike Snow myself. Why flex are pretty? Like I know who he is. Skyrim obviously. was once the land of many butterflies. Because he's Mike, now, the liar. Not so much. Maik is tired now. Go bother somebody else. I s I've never met him before. This is really exciting. Well, where am I going? Oh, I'm good. Evar's dead. Whoa. Excuse you, get out of- get out of here. Quest marker. I ain't doing that. There's a mountain I'm gonna climb. Oh shit, my first bear! I'm gonna fight the bear! <laughs> Lydia, you are nowhere. Lydia, I'm really disappointed in you right now. But I just want the beehive. I feel like everything's a lot more fragile in the PC version than in the, the PS3 version as well. Okay, I'm here. Now what do I do? Oh. I guess I just go. I was thinking I had stuff I had to do here first, but apparently not. It's fine. I totally thought that guy was sneaking after that chicken, and I didn't know what was happening. Now I do. Okay, give me the lunch take him. The again, well, it's a high not pony. I'm just not that pony takes a lot of work. The path isn't safe. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. Khajiit have... Nimble really? legs. Well, that would... Here, take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside. I can't believe this guy brings them food, like up 7,000 steps, just constantly. And it's like, oh, I'd feel bad to charge them. Like, oh my god. That's the most selfless man in all of, um, all of Skyrim. Well, except for that one Khajiit. Um, by Dawnstar. Because we went over the fact that he's like the best person. Oh. 
<laughs> the fact that I just kind of like one shot all the wolves is really funny to me. Because it's like they run up just like so ready to like kill me and I just like slap them and they die. Man, Lydia, I don't mean to complain, but you're not very helpful if you're always like 10,000 leagues below me. Hey, Barknar. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. What are you doing? I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the emblems. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. That sounds terrible. Thinking about walking up 7,000 7, steps makes me tired. Don't I get to fight a troll up here on the way? I feel like I gotta fight a troll. I like how that guy is just like, oh, I like to, you know, walk the 7,000 steps. It's pretty relaxing. But there's like a troll somewhere on them. I feel like there is. Like, I, I guess I could be completely wrong by the fact that there's a troll. But I really feel like there's always a troll on the steps. Because it's like, kind of like, you know, like a mini boss. I remember one time um, when I just started playing a game, but I did um, a new start. So I like started in Dawnstar. And I ran into a troll. I ran into two trolls. I think I took one by myself and I was like almost dead in the second one. I suddenly realized this is another one, right? So I like, I went running back into town. <laughs> and there was a really cool um, Khajiit caravan outside of town. And then I got really sad because I was like, oh no, they're going to die fighting this troll, right? But. And then some random lady came running out of town in, like, just her normal clothes. Oh, there it is. There's a troll. But she came running out in, like, just her normal clothes, right? And was like... Dude. And, like, to fight him with her fists. So she died. But it was okay. Oh! Oh. I was not prepared. Oh, I'm really not prepared for this. Oh, shit. Lydia! Help! Oh, Zee! Oh, is she already down? Lydia! Oh, she's up. So, okay. I had my first death, but you know, what did we say? I'm gonna, I was gonna give myself a grace period. So, now I know better. Oh, oh Lydia, get back up, please. Lydia! Wah! Wah! <laughs> I am the Dova King, and it's fine. Oh, shit, why aren't I running? <gasps> cause I can't run, cause now I'm stupid! It's fine, guys. Did I just kill Lydia? I really hope I didn't. Oh, I might have actually killed Lydia. I didn't think my shouts would kill her. Oh my gosh. Lydia, are you okay? I killed Lydia! Okay. I can't kill Lydia. I'm gonna fucking kill this asshole. Get down here. Hey. Oh shit. Man. This is rough. Punch guy's having some issues. I maybe should have bought ten potions and shit in Ivar's dead. But I don't really want to go down the mountain now. Sometimes you gotta believe. You gotta believe sometimes. It's fine. Oh my god. This is just like the beginning of Half-Life. Okay, well, 
we did well. Thank you, Lydia, for your uh, efforts in this trying time of ours. We did it. Awesome. Yes. I feel like that was... Ooh. Huh. I'll do an... That is his name. I mean, that's the good guy's name. Well, it's one of the dragon's names. Lydia, we did so well. Lydia! Woo! But yeah, okay, so what I was saying before was... Like, although I set out thinking it'd be cool to do one of those, you know, um... When you die, you die for real Let's Plays of Skyrim? Well, not... Like, not <laughs> die for real. I will be fine. But I mean, your character... But I think with punch cats are generally kind of hard to play. So it might not be very viable to do that. So from now, I am thinking that that's not going to be a thing. Unless I get to a point where I'm just really good at killing everything. And then I will totally be all up for that again. These fucking... Do you think that that poor man who lived in the village, like, they make him fight that troll every single time he comes through here? Maybe he just runs past it. I forget if, like, Skyrim enemies, like, how far they will follow you. I feel like it's fairly far. It's, it's really hard, especially when you leave behind your companions. Your companions, like, you know, kneeling down forever away while you're just running and leaving them. I am a terrible companion to have. I am now realizing as I say this. I did it. Here's your dumb thing. Hey, stupid dudes. I came up your dumb mountain for you. Give me my shouting powers. Let's get this quest started. Okay, well, huh? who's... Oh, it's Lydia. I was like, who's taking out their sword? I don't like that. Yo. Your beard is indeed gray. Oh, a dragon I would have been upset otherwise. At this moment in the Are you not allowed to come here until you're like old and your your beard is gray or like First, let us is it just like you, you know a coincidence let us taste of your voice yeah I'll fucking yell at you right in your face <laughs> how was that he's upset he's offended dragonborn <laughs> this is you welcome to high i did it i am Master i beat the game Angel. i speak for the graybeard <laughs> i speak for the trees now, tell me dragonborn why have you come? I don't know, maybe because you shouted across the entirety of Skyrim we to find me, to and it was awkward, so I kind of had to pick up. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon. It's like I could have ignored it normally, but no, you said to do it so publicly that I couldn't. You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. I want there to be 50. You have shown that you are dragonborn. I have. I you yelled have at your face. That's what you gotta do. But do you have the discipline and temperament to Probably follow Probably not. The I'm just gonna say it right now. Probably not. Uh, that remains to be seen. It doesn't mean to be seen. It's Without a problem. Training, not. Have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thoom, a shout. You have beautiful eyes. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability. So to I didn't learn realize that they were. Power. They had surrounded us like All that. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word. Your shout will become progressively stronger. Master Einarth will the, now um, teach you Grow. A second word when you just know Foos, right? Force. It sounds like the girl's Foos is so funny to me. Because, like, you heard Foos row down in the trailers, tongue. right? Combine it with but, like, force when you're a girl, you say Foos. It's just this really soft, like, Foos! I actually was a little disappointed when I first played Skyrim, and that was, like, my voice, which is Foos! I think it's cooler once you get all of them. Am I supposed to do it? Oof. I didn't do it. I didn't do it though. 
but learning it's a word of bad. power is only the first thing. Because that one is made for constant practice Ooh. in order to use it in a shout. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. Oh. I don't have. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Can absorb a I can't do it yet because I don't have another dragon soul. Directly. As part of your initiation, so many words like Master nouns with dragon in front of them. Dragonborn, dragon soul, of Rome. dragon bone. That's it, actually. So I guess it's not really that many. Oh, um, excuse you. Lisa, can you please ask first? Lydia. Oh. Ah. Lydia, can you please get out of the way? I'm gonna murder you in an accident. Oh. Oh, sorry, I'm just so clumsy. You learn quickly. So clumsy. Once more. I thought Lydia was dead. I always think Lydia's gonna be dead. I have nightmares about Lydia being dead. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Lydia's tired of Follow this. Master She's with Bonnie. me. Oh, Lydia. That's not very nice. She left me. Lydia, can you, you grab his business? The, the man is trying to talk. Lydia, just stand on my word. What? Yes, I'm so good. I thought I was gonna mess it up. That was gonna be really embarrassing. All these old men were gonna laugh at me. Your quick mastery. And they were never gonna let me hang out with their it. club. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jurgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Remain true to the way of the voice. Runs off to become a thief. Runs off to join the Dark Brotherhood. He was a great war leader of the ancient Nords, a master of the voice or tongue. After the disaster at Red Mountain, where the Nord army was annihilated, he spent many years pondering the meaning of that terrible defeat. He finally came to realize that the gods had punished the Nords for their arrogant and blasphemous misuse of the voice. He was the Those first fuckers. to understand that the voice should be used solely for the glory and worship of the gods, not the glory of men. This guy must be really Jürgen fun at parties. Windcaller's mastery of the voice eventually Everyone's like, hey, show us your cool voice thing. He's like, no, it must, use, it must be voice. used for the glory of the gods, not for the glory of men, or whatever he said. I don't remember. I'm going to go do the thing he told me Sky to do. Above. Voice within. Sky above voice within. Okay, um, I think that this is actually a good place to call it for the evening. I'm glad that I got the stuttering figured out. That was cool. Oh, look at, look at, look at, um, shit, what's it called? White Run. Right Run, so tiny. But yeah, um, thanks everyone for watching. We will go get the thing from the thing. Oh, that's, you know. I can just reuse that. I can just say, oh, end of Skyrim. Let's go get the thing from the thing, because that's what every quest is. But yeah, so I'll do that next time, and we'll punch more things. Woo! Yeah. Go team.